if convicted. Well, Hollywood stars are calling South Georgia home for the next few weeks. Film crews are shooting the movie Fishers of Men in Bainbridge. But beyond the silver screen comes real opportunities for small towns in a down economy. ABC 27's Greg Angel has more. It's lights, camera, action in South Georgia. I think this has been awesome. Oh, my God. I hope this puts Bainbridge on the map. Denise Webb is a local Bainbridge resident cast as an extra in the film Fishers of Men, now being shot across South Georgia. The cast of the faith-based film include country musician Travis Trick, Ray Weiss, and Bo Derrick. It's a film that was nearly shot somewhere else until a chance phone call between producers and the local economic alliance told him that we were shooting a 1950s period piece. Uh, he immediately said, wow, you guys need to take a look at our courthouse. Uh, our courthouse is stuck in time. Making the deal sweeter to shoot states away from Hollywood is Georgia's generous film tax incentive. It essentially offers filmmakers a 30% rebate on whatever they spend here. Budget on our project is $1.8 million. That includes the, the pr entire production from A to Z. Uh, within that budget, I've had to budget almost $440,000 uh, just for lodging and food in Bainbridge, where we're, where we're keeping our crew. According to the Georgia Film Commission, television and movie producers last year invested more than $647 million. So how does your town get a piece of that pie? One of the first things that brought us here originally were the photographs that uh, Rick McCaskill sent us uh, of the Bainbridge Courthouse and of some of the streets. And The easiest thing a town can do, Camp says, post pictures online. He says towns can put up many photos of potential shoot locations. A great resource to help in this process is the Georgia Film Commission because Camp says they know who's coming in for projects. They literally rolled the red carpet out for us, allowed us access to courthouses and churches. Uh, we were able to block off streets and things of that nature. They really uh, facilitated our every need as a production company. Would you certainly welcome more projects like this? Today? I sure would. I sure would. That was Greg Angel reporting. Crews are filming the entire movie in only 25 days. They'll be wrapping up in early October with a theatrical release slated for early next year. Looking forward to that.